Hello my darling divas, it's your girl Jazzy GGB82. I hope by the time this video reaches you, you all are blessed and all are in the best spirits. I'm coming to you today with a tutorial and I was sent um, some clipping extensions from irresistibleme.com. I was sent um, Indian Remy hair that is 16 inches, the color is a 1B. And I was sent about 200 grams of hair. I think that equivalents to a bundle, maybe two, I'm not sure. But this is what the hair looks like. The consistency from the top, as you can see, I didn't take it apart, but the consistency from the top all the way to the bottom seems pretty thick. Do I honestly feel that this will do my whole head? No, I don't. I don't feel this is enough, but what I will do, I will just make it do what it does. Um, let me bend. Do I have a lot of short hairs? I see short hairs. Check for the split ends. Hardly no split ends. Hardly no split ends, as you can see. But as you can see here, how at the ends it's all thin. So I would be cutting about maybe about a good two inches off, maybe three to get it to be right the way it's supposed to be. Okay, so straggly looking ends. Y'all can see that. Okay. Um, I'm gonna pull out some hair. I have gray hairs in here. I have a couple of them. The hair's pretty soft. I'm gonna pull some strands out for elasticity. Okay. Wow, elasticity is absolutely perfect. Elasticity is great. Um, let's check for shedding. It's better for me to do it this way and not to take it apart so I can show you. Okay. I've got some shedding here, which is minimal. Nothing harsh, not a lot. I'm gonna take out the hair that I just got out, which is was a lot, it was not a little, it wasn't, it wasn't a lot. And I'm gonna do it one more time, just to do my second check. Here we go again, so I got like two strands here. Well, the shedding is minimal, nothing. Horrid. Let's take this apart. I'm gonna cut this off. I can pull it off. I just pulled it off. So let's look at the wefting. The hair's pretty soft. It's really nice. It's soft. It's very straight texture. It's not it, to me. This is not from my texture of hair. But I'm good at making things work well. But hmm, maybe not. But. Let's look at the wefting itself. The, the wefting construction is good. Very good weft construction. Beards are perfect. Bearding, absolutely perfect. And they put the clippings, they sewed the clippings on and the clippings the way they sewed them in they went all the way from the the side from all the way from the end to the middle to the end okay so yeah that was done properly and it's secured from the end of the at the start of the wefting to where it stops and on the other side so that's cool so as you can see here's a little piece right here so these probably go for my little top pieces there which is cool of course, I'm gonna go through every single one of them, every single one of them to make sure. Construction well, beards perfect. Look how many clips that they put on this particular track right here on this particular track. One, two, three, four. Perfect. Oh, the, hair's, the hair's pretty. Pretty, very pretty. So I know it's gonna curl nice. I can see that already. Let's go to the next one. 
beard is perfect. Yeah, this, yeah. Construction well. No lazy job on putting on the clippings at all. Show you. So right here, as you can see how nice and thick it comes and then at the ends they look straggly. As you can see what I can see, they look straggly. More on this side, looks straggly on this end. As I'm going through, I'm seeing, I'm, you know, I'm looking and I'm watching, I'm looking at the hair, you know. Of course, it's in front of me. So, yeah. This one is rather thick. Yeah. This one has a couple of grave hairs. Ends are straggly. So here's the next batch. The ends are fine here. Well, overall, nothing that I can't work with. Um, but the hair is pretty soft, very soft. And let's begin. So what you are going to do is you are going to look for the extension that you're going to look for the extension that goes to each part of your hair where it fits. So that's basically what you're going to be doing. You're just going to be fitting it in where it goes. And I'm just separating them as of right now. This is my nape area. So I can put this on my nape. So you're going to pop these open. Pop it open and you're going to slide it in. 